friends, and welcome to the Joyce Kilmer Memorial Forest. This is a very special place in the Nantahala National Forest, the far east side of the Great Smoky Mountains. Here you'll find some of the largest trees found on the east coast of the United States. Some are 20 feet in diameter and over 100 feet tall. It's a very special place. I'm glad you're here. Welcome. A lot of information about Joyce Kilmer here. Alfred Joyce Kilmer was born December 6, 1886. He was known as a poet and a war hero. He was truly an American hero. He died in action from a sniper's bullet July 30th, 1918. His poetry is what he's best known for, specifically a poem entitled Trees. This was part of a collection of other poems he wrote entitled Trees and Other Things that was published in 1914. Joyce left behind a wife and five children and a legacy that earned him a place in time forever here in the Nantahala National Forest. His name is immortalized in this gift to the American people. On the drive in, I noticed some campers and this is a primitive camping location. It's very nice. You have 14 days, you're allowed to stay here in the same spot and wander around the forest. And this is a really beautiful part of the forest. These trees are huge. Someone's left a walking stick. There's a place where you can donate to keep the forest healthy. And the poem. Definitely the coolest trail map that I have seen probably ever. It's carved into wood. It's a little cold today for that. I think we're going to pass that trail. But we will take the lower loop and maybe the upper loop too. The lower loop trail is closed. So we are going to follow the sign here to the upper loop trail. It begins right here. Starting to see some very large trees. It's a pretty big paw print. Wow, that's a big tree. Man. Wow. Kilmer wasn't just a war hero and an accomplished poet. He was considered the leading American Roman Catholic poet and lecturer of his generation because of his prophetic writing about the natural world and his faith. Look at the size of this tree. It's one of the biggest trees I've ever seen. <laughs> because of his work and honor, after his untimely death, the veterans of foreign wars requested that a fitting stand of trees act as a living memorial to Joyce. The U.S. Forest Service dedicated the 17,013 acres of one of the nation's most impressive remnants of old growth forest, which contains more than 100 species of trees, many of which are more than 400 years old. This is truly a majestic forest. I think 
this is bigger than the last one. As I hike these trails, I'm thinking about the thousands of people that have been here before me, from the Indians to the early settlers and the pioneers, and now us. Seeing the same exact trees that they saw hundreds of years before our country was even founded. This is amazing. Seems as though the trail has disappeared on me. I thought it was on the right path, but I guess not. I've landed here in this very beautiful part of the forest. It's trickling water falling over these mossy rocks. I'm just gonna hang out here for a while. The trail kind of looks like it goes out there, but it disappears into the leaves. This is one of the most worked on trails I've ever been on. Everywhere you look, there's work that's been done. Take good care of this one. I used to be in landscaping, sometimes have to dig through some roots. I have never seen a root that size before. Good grief. It belongs to this giant monster. Trees by Joyce Kilmer. I think that I shall never see a poem lovely as a tree, a tree whose hungry mouth is pressed against the earth's sweet flowing breast, a tree that looks at God all day and lifts her leafy arms to pray, a tree that may in summer wear a nest of robins in her hair, upon whose bosom snow has lain, who intimately lives with rain. Poems are made by fools like me, but only God can make a tree. Huh. Could be the biggest so far. These trees have a spirit. You can just feel it. I'm the only one out here. I haven't seen anyone else, but I feel like I'm not alone. You know? It's like the forest is breathing or something magical Big tree cool girl right next to the parking lot are public restrooms which are open they also provide three picnic areas right by the creek with grills and bear-proof trash cans. I don't think I've ever seen a picnic table that sturdy. <laughs> with the trees being as big as they are out here, I guess it makes sense. That is huge. Thanks for joining me today on one of the coolest hikes that I have ever been on at the Joyce Kilmer Memorial Forest. This has been really, really cool. I appreciate you joining me out here, friends. I'll see you in the next video.